Hello and welcome back to Nibble Pibbly. Quick video now about uh, the Odroid N2 um, board. This is a bit like a Raspberry Pi, but it's more powerful. It's certainly more powerful than the Raspberry Pi 4, I think. Um, it's got a Amlogic S922X processor, um, quad core Cortex A73 running at 1.8 gigahertz and a dual core A53 processor running at 1.9 gigahertz. It's got a Mali G52 GPU with six execution engines running at 846 megahertz. It's got four gig of DDR4 RAM. Um, storage wise it's got um, a an eMMC module, of which I've got two, which I'll show you in a minute. It's also got one micro SD card slot as well. Um, I don't think you can use them both at the same time. I think there is a switch on the board there, I think, which allows you to switch between eMMC and micro SD for booting. It's got a, if I turn it round, it's got a one gigabyte LAN port, which is there. It's got a, um, um, I don't think it's got Wi-Fi built in. I think you have to use a separate USB adapter. Um, the video port is HDMI 2.1, which supports 4K. And also, there, uh, you can also have a uh, composite video using a 3.5mm jack. Um, the audio, you can have a stereo line out, which I think is that one there. It's got uh, four USB 3. Uh, host ports um, and what's uh, and and in term, terms of the board, the board, um, the CPU and everything is underneath. But the base of the board, as you can see, is an aluminium heatsink. Um, so again, a bit like the um, Flerk case I showed for the Raspberry Pi Four the other day. Um, the case. Uh, uses a heatsink. There is a fan. There is a fan um, um, interface on here if you want to use a fan. Um, but it also comes with. I'm just going to open it now. It also comes with a clear case, which I went for black. There, which goes on top, as well as um, the main part, which is here. So, so they they both go on top. Not quite sure which way around it goes at the moment, but I think it's this this way round. Um, and yeah, it goes that way round like like that. Um, you have the primary use of this is either a um, you know a small form factor um, a Linux or Android machine. I say it's got four gig of RAM, so it's like quite capable. But really, the main use of this, I think, is going to be for it, for it, em, emulation and I see it as a real competitor to the Ras, Raspberry Pi 4. I haven't as yet tried any emulators out but I will um, set, set it up and do another video um, showing it in action. Um, it was about £82 I think. The case was about £5 um, from O, um, I got this directly from Odroid U UK. Um, again, I bought it with my own money. Um, um, it hasn't been sent to me. It hasn't been sponsored or anything like that. Um, I just thought it'd be interesting to show the board itself for anyone that might want a uh, an alternative to the Raspberry Pi Four. Um, um, I'm going to look into it, as I say, in more detail. And uh, that there'll be another video with uh, gameplay footage and things to show you how it looks and how it works. Um, that's about it. So thanks for watching. Um, please uh, like and subscribe if you like my content. And please click the notification bell in order to uh, receive alerts when I post new uh, videos. Thanks. Bye.